we're standing in the middle of a road here. <laughs> so this road is actually a really special road. Um, the City of Burlington, in conjunction with Conservation Halton, have worked to close it for Jefferson salamanders who migrate during their breeding period from one side of the road to the other every year. It's a phenomenon that you won't see unless you came out in the middle of the night because that's when the salamanders make their annual migration from one side of King Road in Burlington to the other. What's special about this particular section of road that we need to close it? So on either side of the road, you have um, breeding habitat for Jefferson salamanders and they go underground in the, in the early fall and they burrow through leaf litter into the soil and they hibernate and then they'll come up in the spring and go back to their pond and it could be on one side of the road or the other. Um, so you've got this movement between uh, either side of the road. So that's because there's like little pockets of water on either side of this road. Right, exactly. Tell me about these salamanders and why they're protected. So Jefferson salamanders are endangered um, in the province and one of the biggest threats to Jefferson salamander is habitat loss followed by road mortality. And so anything that we can do to stop them from being killed is a benefit to the population. And a healthy salamander population is an indication of a healthy environment. Salamanders in general are actually really interesting because they're, they're almost like your indicator species. They'll tell you whether or not your forest is healthy. In this situation, we've got blue spotted, uh, yellow spotted, Jefferson salamanders, as well as red back salamanders all living in this location. Well, unfortunately, we won't get to see any of the salamanders during the day because they only come out at night. Conservation Halton is hoping that people don't try to come out at night to see them because they don't want to risk any of them getting run over or trampled on. In Burlington, Audra Brown, City News.